Welcome. This video is going to quickly detail the process of installing ArcDPS for the purposes of logging, as well as how to log fights and upload them. If you'd like a more in-depth overview of ArcDPS, or an explanation on how to use it to actually track your DPS in-game, change build templates, and more, please check out my other video. To begin, you'll need to navigate to deltaconnected.com slash ArcDPS, and scroll down to the bottom of the page to see the current releases. It'll be a link labeled x64 current. Click on that, and then click the file named d3d9.dll to download it. Now navigate to both your Downloads directory and your Guild Wars 2 install directory. Guild Wars 2 is usually installed in your program files, but if you picked a different path during the game's installation, you'll need to go there instead. You'll know that you're in the right place if there's a huge file called gw2.dat, upwards of about 40 gigabytes. Once you're there, open the bin64 folder and drag the d3d9.dll file you downloaded in. I've already got ArcDPS installed, so I won't be dragging it in for this recording. Now launch Guild Wars 2, and if this is your first time using ArcDPS, you should see an options menu. To understand the other settings here, be sure to check out my other video. Today we're just going to focus on the settings under Logging. Click Logging to expand it, and make sure the following options are checked. Save EVTC logs after encounters. This actually logs the fights that you get into. Lock target to encounter NPC. This locks the logged targets to the encounter NPC, meaning the boss in raids. And use NPC names in EVTC save path. This will create a bunch of folders for each boss in your directory. It makes sorting a lot easier. You can pick players or guild names as well if you'd like to further sort your logs, but those are the ones that I recommend the most. And now you're ready to fight. Once you get into an encounter with a boss or a training golem, the combat will be logged. But where do they go? Well, for ArcDPS, logs are stored under My Documents, Guild Wars 2, Add-ons, ArcDPS, ArcDPS Combat Logs. You should see a folder with boss names under that directory once you've actually gotten into some fights. For demonstration purposes, I've got a golem log here. Now, there are a couple of sites you can use for uploading logs, but the two most common ones we use are GW2 Radar and DPS Report. Links will be in the description for both. To upload logs, simply drag and drop the files onto the page. Your log will upload, and from there you'll be able to see fight statistics, DPS, mechanics, and more.